I'm not a vampire, not an alien. I'm not the fucking mummy. I'm a goblin. I am your cowboy. I am the Venom. Oh my god, Venom let to be carnage. I was like, okay, I wanna see the reviews for this movie after I watched it. I was like, everybody's gonna love it. Everybody almost hates it. I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? This one is a masterpiece. I like it. Uh, uh, sure, it's not perfect, you know. I say a masterpiece as in, it's pretty freaking good. Uh, it's better than most Marvel movies. That's just my personal opinion, not Endgame and all those kind of things. But uh, Captain Marvel, better than that. Better than... Uh, better than Spider-Man, the original Spider-Man in my opinion. Kind of thing. Not as uh, Tom Holland Spider-Man, but better than that. Not so good as Amazing Spider-Man, but it's up there. It's uh, kind of uh, close to that. Uh, I like it. Venom Letter Be Carnage is pretty good. Sure, it's simple. It's very simple done, but it's very good uh, job kind of thing. It's uh, Venom. Uh, it's this weird relationship uh, 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 kind of Eddie Brock has with the symbiote. They're like friends, but they're also this relationship. I like no, no, no. You can, uh, I want to bite heads off uh, kind of thing for for a reason. Uh, from from thing, I need something that's in the brain. And chicken brains are not good. Also, I, I named them. It's like this funny, dark, funny side on things that I really love. Kind of thing. I love my ass off of in this movie. It's very darker kind of tone, uh, kind of thing. And funny humor is also a bit darker. But I love it. What can I say? I love it. Kind of thing. So uh, also, Eddie Brock gets his debut after uh, after finally going to. Uh, uh, getting a, a, the only statement he wants uh, is from uh, uh, K K Cassidy kind of thing. He's gonna get murdered. Gonna we also find out that he fall he killed his whole mother, his sister, his kind of thing. Uh, they abused him, he says, but it's like he is a freaking psychopath that murders a lot of people. It's like, yeah, I understand that you want to murder them, but also feels like you also could have made that up because you sound like somebody that would, would make up some psychopathic reason like why did I do this? Um, I did it because they abused me. That's the new trend, right? That's the new trend everybody kind of uh, starts uh, Let's say I abused them! That kind of thing. It's like this and then he kills some more kind of people and eventually comes also in the school kind of thing where he falls in love with this girl that can scream. That uh, kind of thing. In the comic, she is actually a symbiote. Uh, she uh, that can scream eventually, but in this one, she's just just a person that can scream. What? It, while it is a bad kind of thing because she literally can scream, and uh, symbiotes are bad in that kind of thing. So yeah, and Carnage gets created after Eddie Brock uh, gets kind of thing, and Venom uh, loses his mind. It's like, oh, I'm gonna protect you, kind of thing. He's also. Uh, tries to do his best to protect uh, uh, protect Eddie Brock kind of thing. Tries to do the good thing. He tries to do good, but he's not really good and good being good uh, kind of thing. He's like also like he loses his anger very fast. What Eddie keeps uh, like a little bit to himself, but uh, but Venom is not good in his anger uh, issues. So he's like I'm gonna uh, kill him kind of thing. And uh, he tries tries to kind of even uh, tries to get a. Uh, 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 tries to get them as uh, a, a get them. It's like, oh, sorry, I lost. I should not have lost that kind of thing. But because of that blood, because of the bite kind of thing, uh, he uh, kind of thing. He he leaks it, the blood off uh, kind of thing, and the blood of, of uh, Eddie Brock kind of thing is also with Venom's blood. So it's kind of creates carnage. It creates carnage. It's not like I hoped that carnage and. Uh, and uh, uh, Carnage and uh, and uh, uh, well, Carnage and uh, you know the killer uh, ourself himself kind of thing were one person that's like this, but instead we get just a new symbiote uh, that's born from that anger, from his rage, from his kind of thing, and a red one that's like in blood, pure kind of thing. Uh, but he is also, while the psychopathic version of him is like, yes, let's be psychos. Like, he breaks out, goes, gets his girlfriend, and he wants to get his dad. Uh, Carnage wants to go after Venom, uh, kind of thing. 
and uh, so that all kind of happens. They they all want to do that. Uh, he does this scratch. He does this. Uh, in a, uh, Carnage is very much like he seems like freaking powerful as hell, like really, really powerful kind of thing. And the uh, it's like really powerful, really kind of thing. He seems like a, but the only thing he still uh, screams and kind of thing. And they try to fight, uh, kind of thing. They get to uh, scream. They have this old thing, and she tries to scream. This is like when Carnage starts to hate and uh, hate uh, he hate Cassidy's girlfriend. But they're both psychopaths, so it's like, it fits them right, like, it's not like, oh, he is in love, he is kind of thing, he's gonna become good, no, they're two fucking psychopaths, Carnage being the third one, but Carnage doesn't like screams, he really hates uh, screams, so this girlfriend that he has, while he uh, he tries to be friendly at, it's kind of, but he also has this hard voice, while Carnage normally has this like, small, uh, petite voice, like, ah! Kill you. Like this very much low, uh, high, high pitched voice kind of thing, more kind of thing than uh, Venom. But here they have all those darker uh, tones of voices. Uh, that's the only bad thing I think uh, I feel around this. But Carnage is like very mayhem, very chaos, ca ca able to kind of thing. Does love doing this, and it, in the beginning they seem to like really good. But it's like scream that makes Carnage and uh, Carnage uh, look so bad with each other. Uh, kind of thing. With Car Carnage cannot hear scream. Scream. Can scream is very much in this, so that uh, Carnage, uh, so that Khaleesi Cassidy and uh, Carnage have something to fight against. Because while they love the chaos, while they love the Carnage that they do, while they love doing all those kind of uh, uh, bad things, it's also like. Yeah, they maybe love doing that, but they're also uh, in uh, uh, they have one thing that they don't like, and that's scream. She loves scream. She loves kind of a uh, kind of thing. But while Carnage hates scream, he wants her to die. She ends like being in line. But scream is not somebody you can just keep in line. Scream will scream if you're freaking trying. So she gets stopped a few times. And this is why Venom tries to get it, even though they kidnap Anna, they can't. But they're also more co compatible because while Venom has like the personality a little bit di different, personality a little bit like, okay, we could be this maniac, we could uh, kind of thing. He even leaves, it's like this whole thing that Venom tries to be a superhero, but uh, Eddie wants to be just left alone. And eventually, Venom goes his own way, tries to get from body to body, but. No body seems to stick, all body seems to die with him and that kind of thing because they're incredible. He tries to get kind of thing, tries to be even part, he's like I'm Venom and I'm kind of thing. He does this whole whole funny thing that I actually like. It's a bit cringe kind of thing, but it's still funny. And he tries to be like, yeah I'm the coolest man, I'm a superhero. I'm trying to kind of thing, he was like he parties, he kind of thing, he tries to to be like, uh, uh, Eddie was wrong for like being a uh, hero is cool. And eventually, he, uh, he kind of dies, goes to back because either he needs chocolate or our brains. Mostly brains, but chocolate works too, kind of thing. Uh, so he goes uh, to the store where Eddie break kind of thing, and went into the cashier that knows about Eddie. It's like, I know about Eddie, I know, kind of thing. And eventually, Eventually, uh, Eddie comes there, tries to find Car uh, find Venom because Carnage now is on a rampage, just uh, uh, on a rampage kind of thing. T uh, tries to, I think, uh, kidnap uh, for Anna kind of thing, but first, like, not. First, was uh, not there yet because she's she, uh, Carnage is just on a rampage. Eddie's out in jail, kind of thing. She finds out that, like, to uh, to break uh, Venom up, uh, uh, well. To break Eddie out of jail, she needs Venom. And eventually she finds Ven a Venom in this country. Like, wait, are you Darren? And then it's like, oh, you're so beautiful. You're so good. It's like very Venom seems to be like, oh, stop. Like, very much love compliments. Love being the hero. Love being like, the being loved kind of thing. He very much likes to be loved. He likes to have some attention towards him. He wants to be a hero, even though he doesn't. Really know how to be a hero. He just thinks like this is what heroes do, right? Good kind of thing. Bad guys killing bad guys, kind of thing. 
he doesn't really know how to uh, be a hero uh, eventually but eventually it's like enough he knows enough to be a hero to get uh, to get there and carnage uh, well carnage is doing mayhem scream uh, tries to get her scream eventually gets anna and uh, and the kind of thing, Venom goes after him. They get this whole beautiful fight, seeing that Carnage is like way more powerful, and all kind of thing. But they're very much fighting each other, Carnage and uh, Kesty, because they're both psychopaths, no doubt about it. They're both unredeemable, Carnage and kind of thing. But they have, even a Scream is unredeemable. But they have one thing, one thing that uh, while uh, Carnage hates Scream. Uh, clearly Cassidy loves Scream kind of thing because this love of his life he does like Scream's kind of thing so they eventually fight Carnage sees them kind of thing tries to keep Cassidy kind of thing it feels like they're not compatible because they love for Scream it's like one hates Scream the other one loves Scream and that's why they fight each other and this is also why Venom wins that kind of thing Venom tries to get Carnage kind of thing. Yeah, it's also this cool thing on my marriage kind of thing. Before this, when he comes in this church and it's like, he sees it, uh, it's Carnage being red. It's like, oh, that's the red one. Nope. And goes up. It's like, what, what the hell are you doing? Come on, man. Come back. It's like, why are you like, oh, no, that's a red one. I'm not doing it. Like, okay, you can uh, get the uh, hats off uh, from all of them. If you find, uh, can you say, really? Okay. Then he comes in. They have this fight, this big giant fight. It feels like bigger than the first one. I feel like this movie was better than the first one. Also a bit more funny, but that could be my personal opinion about that one. Everybody has another thing of humor. Uh, but I love the, uh, the humor kind of thing in this movie. It was not too much, but also not too little. Uh, kind of thing. And Carnage being the villain, a maniac and uh, kind of thing. But still have love. And even although after all of that, after Carnage finally dies but sounds because... Apparently Scream needs to, instead of just kind of thing, Venom just knocks Scream uh, to the bell, the bell kind of starts happening, she screams uh, uh, while uh, while falling as hard as she can to make uh, Carnage fall to the death, Venom falls almost to the death, but Venom tries to sa uh, save, uh, like goes into others kind of thing, tries to save, save uh, Carnage, uh, Venom tries to save Eddie Brock while Carnage just let's uh, Eddie. Let, just let's uh, let's uh, clean cast the can on the ground, and then comes to uh, try to get in. It's like, oh, you got smashed on the ground. I'm not in a worry, kind of thing. I will heal that, and it's all over, that uh, kind of thing. And it's like that. That's kind of thing. But then Venom eats eats Carnage up, like his head off, and uh, his whole kind of thing. And then he, and then uh, and then. Uh, then clearly Cassidy like, I just wanted a friend, man. And Venom is like, ah, fuck you. And eats his head up. It's like, he come like, okay, that's apparently all for Carnage. Uh, I felt like it was maybe smaller, a smaller done, like a more, more consistent, more smaller than the psychopath on the loose. And, but it's also real big kind of thing. I feel like, sure, Carnage could be a bigger villain, could be kind of thing, but it's really very well done. He gets killed, he gets kind of thing, and it's also one movie. Uh, while Carnage is a good villain to keep on coming back, I also feel like this is not a TV show. We don't need to uh, every time uh, having some villain coming back. Uh, it feels like sure I would have loved to see him come back, and Carnage is big, but I'm also like, eh, you know, someday it's gonna end and reboot it, so I'm gonna enjoy the the move of Carnage, and I did. I I fi find Venom much better than in the first one uh, kind of thing. I think it was very entertainment, entertaining, and uh, I also, uh, even though Carnage ending kind of thing was a little bit of thing, I still think it was pretty good, well done. And af after that, like Eddie kind of thing, doing this Hawaii thing, doing this, going on this beautiful vacation with Venom, Venom uh, uh, King and Son, they're going to sleep, and then Venom is like, I have like more things that I hide from you, because if I... I uh, uh, made you see everything that I know, we would all die. Uh, you, a uh, human mind cannot uh, uh, comprehend. So he is like, okay, give me a little taste. He does that, tries to give him a little taste, but then they at the wrong universe. They somehow transform to an, uh, to another universe, to uh, the Marvel universe, and that's uh, now we see Spider-Man being a menace kind of thing. And it's also like, oh, he's even he's a menace. I need to get and that makes it like, oh, you have a 
but I hope if Spider-Man crossover kind of happens with uh, that we still see see uh, v uh, see that darker side that not that Marvel uh, kind of thing but also the dark side that Sony has made from uh, Venom kind of thing that we still see that coming into fruition that it's not like oh m another Marvel movie yay kind of thing anyway that's pretty much all I got for you I liked it I give it a solid legendary plus kind of thing it's not Omega kind of thing but it's close to an Omega level uh, 10 kind of thing but it's a legend more legendary I feel like it's a must watch movie but that's my personal opinion because I see a lot of people that don't like this movie while I say nah, it's one of the better movies out there that I freaking watch like kind of thing. I don't. I think it's better than I don't know. Uh, better than a uh, charm. Better than uh, it's better than uh, well, wait. Not the Batman movie. The new Batman movie I didn't watch yet. Uh, it's uh, well, I'm trying to find a good movie that everybody loves, but that I I t think this one is still better. Uh, there's some lots of Marvel movies I think is uh, is not so. Uh, that this Venom movie is better at uh, the original Spider-Man kind of thing. Everybody loves that. I think this Venom movie is mu much better than those tr a trilogy of movies. But that's last, uh, uh, like I said, just my opinion. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this uh, Venom uh, review, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Oh, let me know your opinion. But no, bye bye. Then the days got worse and worse, and now you see I've gone completely out of my mind.